Well, you get cooped up on that campus, stuck, stuck up on a hill, especially in wintertime. Um, and not only is it difficult to get off, but I just don't have the motivation, the incentive. And then they, they started this new uh, bike share program, and I said, count me in, slam dunk, came down here, found this bike path, never in my life, and I'm just living it up. It's a beautiful May 8th day. At my sister's college, they had, uh, they had a similar thing, but it was a, it was a club on campus called the, uh, the Gilded Bicycle Guild, and uh, they had these bikes that they painted yellow. I feel like I would ride them more if maybe more people rode them. People who already have a sense that it's better to like transport yourself on a mechanism like the bicycle than a mechanism like the car uh, understand that sustainability is a good thing, so I'm glad it's there for them and for others to take advantage of. I, don't know, I feel like they should hire like professional bikers to like go around on the bikes and like do tricks downstairs and stuff. I don't know. My thoughts on these bikes, I don't know, they're red and blue. Nice colors. <laughs> I'm about to get me a bike. Right now. <laughs> like shooting hoops, riding our bikes. Now I babysit these kids. They have like their six hours of TV a day and then they go online and play with their little webkins or whatever and they're playing Game Boy and they don't even go outside ever. As the world grows ever more dependent on oil and the US specifically on foreign oil, um, you know, we see places like um, East Asia, China, Southeast Asia, Vietnam, that usually, that um, in years past, you'd see major roads in the cities actually, you know, crowded with bicycles, whereas, and you'd see something like one or two bicycles pass, I mean, uh, one or two cars pass within an hour, and entire societies were dependent, in, uh, dependent on bicycle travel, and it, it almost became like a cultural staple. So now that we see that not only the U.S., which has you know, been using cars heavily for the past hundred years or so, now we see other countries you know, starting to depend on cars and less on bicycles. I think that um, anything that incentivizes people to get out and use a mode of transportation that doesn't infect the environment, I think that's a great thing. Do I enjoy taking bike rides? <laughs> Ask me again.